Well, I'm back to my Pokemon Solar Light Lunar Dark playthrough as I got everyone up to level 37 and some team changes happened. First off, Rex Tite evolved to Tyrax Tite. And also, remember that Tortorock that I caught last episode? Well, say hello to Baldois instead. Although it looks steel, it's still rocking ground as a shit ton of defense. Got a lot better special attack. Oh my god, that special attack was so bad when I got it off screen. Rock Tomb, Bite Bull, those Sandstorm didn't learn any new moves whatsoever. And hey, Bulldox, I believe, one or two levels away from evolving, so that would be very nice, hopefully. And that woman up in um, Pokemon Center that was looking for miss her missing seaweed, I mean, um, weed seed, I found it down there, so I took care of all that. And that man with that deer-like Pokemon gave me a metal coat, so that's very nice. Now, if only I had a, someone with a Steel-type move, that would be very useful. And here we go, continue on the road to get our next badge, but of course, we run into Rick! Oh boy, we saw him in the last episode on Battle Bridge. Didn't battle whatsoever. As he just shoot us off, basically. Stag Run, which that is the other fossil Pokemon that Rick took, which the, um, my um, roleplay took as well. That is Rocket Steel, if I'm correct. So, yep. So much for that high defense, you got one-shotted. Or, or it's your, I think, oh uh, yeah, you're pure grounds. Right, because I have you. Alright, Fire Fang, neutral damage. Shit. Oh god, your quad wait no! Oh my god, a crit just held on! Only problem is now lowered speed. I hope it's not slower. Got that off. Hit off still. Damn, that was close! A crit, quad neat weakness, and just held on! Holy crap, that was close. And of course I still have no idea what your type is, but you just had to hold on. Oh man. Now I gotta worry about um powered up attack. That's going to be a problem. Uh oh no, you have Moxie too, so now I think it's attack is plus free. Oh man. Who's fast? Alright, um, Platy Plash, you're the fastest, so you're going up front. We're going to have to need, I need some now guaranteed to hit first. Bulldoze? There we go. Yeah, get rid of your plus free attack. That actually is a... Scary combination if you manage to land a hit. Lord Spe oh great, Lord Evasive in this. Cost Spring. And of course you're quad weak to Rock Tomb. <laughs> Why would you do Steel Wing? That was stupid. And one shot. That is a good move though for you. Get rid of that count your quad weakness to Rock. Okay, very special defense. Okay, lower special attack. Which is not good. Powerful. Alright, Rock Tomb, since we still have no idea if you're Fire or flying or just flying or whatever you are. No start. Oh, that's right. He doesn't have a starter. That's right. Me, Roddy, and Kara took the starters. Just like blue. But now I gotta heal up. Oh my god. I still can't believe. Um, Rax, I mean, Tyraxatite. That was still impressive that you actually survived that um quad critical hit move. That was impressive. And I noticed that the um. Sprite right there for the nurse is appearing because in the last town was that that sprite did not appear so I have no idea why that's the case. Maybe it's something wrong with the gamer glitch, perhaps. Now, here we are. Route 6. And matter of fact, got that up right now. Bunch of trainers right here. Couple new Pokemon here. Although one of them I already have. Let's get this item right here. A bunch of steel types too. Keep that in mind, although they're not good for the upcoming gym whatsoever, so I'm not going to be using them if I did catch any of them. Yeah, it looks like three, you know, five of these six encounters you've all not seen yet. And there's one of them, Moonstone. With well, that name, I bet you're part rock. Well, let's see. <laughs> yeah, you probably are. Oh my god, I still did a good amount of damage still. Ah, Rage ain't going to do shit, especially since I, I hit first. Well, hopefully you have low HP. There we go. So, looks like you don't have a lot of HP on you. We'll get a good... This will give us a good guesstimate. Okay, 40 damage did half health, so... 60, maybe 70. Low 70s, perhaps, at most. If you got taken down. But that's one of the new encounters. Yeah, it looks like Rock, based upon its... Men, um, Wiki, um, PD, um, Solar Light Lunar Dark Wiki, um, Wikipedia on it. And there's another hiker that looks almost like Rick, like I got confused in that one episode. There's a lot of trainers down there. Now there's two paths. 
Kid it. I mean, Kidlet. That is a new encounter here as well. Pure fire looks like. Yep, it is pure fire. Now, there's two paths you could take. One where I'm actually going looks like leads to a jewel mine. That is closed off until post game. And there's Irip, which is another new encounter, which is steel, and I think flying or ghost. Why did you do rock slide? I told you to do fire fang. And it does look kind of cool. I actually used it um, when I did my playthrough here four years ago. Of that demo, maybe I'll get it again, but it's not going to be on the team anytime soon since the gym upcoming is not good for the types. As we'll put Platy Flash up front. Let's see where this leads. Come on. Of course, you can't just line for that rock because you know that rock. And there's Fiant, which remember, I have Fiant, but it's shiny. That's, what's nor that's what it normally looks like. And I think you're bugging fire, so guess what? You got one shot. Let's see how much EXP you give out. Ooh, that's a good amount still. And remember, um... Oh, it's a breakable rock. Oh, well. Because remember, Plyplash is not holding the lucky egg still. So, God, that would probably be over 700, if not 800 EXP, probably. Okay, this is going to give out a lot. I'll be... If I get a thousand, I'll be happy. I'm... It's gonna be close to a thousand. I would I think it will be a thousand at least. Yep, over a thousand. Nice. Now where does this lead to? There's the jewel mine and Yep, so they're not gonna let me pass. Most likely that's gonna be the case for the rest of the game. Here's a cuddle tree. Looks like this heads to Route 7. So I might have to go back. Ooh, Venom Shock. Oh, Venu Shock, I mean to say. No, I don't think I have Toxic, so that probably would not work out for Bulldogs. Not to mention, not as good special attack. Now, if I get Toxic, that could be a good combination for Bulldogs, Toxic, and Venu Shock. And there's a head buttable tree. Because two of the encounters... Oh, there's one more encounter in the trees. And there's a Wild Moose Stone, which I I don't really have any interest in, although it kind of looks cool, but not right now. I just want to battle it to get that level up, though. There we go. Play Plash at now 38. Let's put Bulldox up front since, like I said, you're one or two levels away from evolving. And matter of fact, you... Oh, that's right. Finflix still has to evolve two more times. That is it, though, for everyone else. Like, they don't evolve at all again after this. So Bulldox has to evolve one more time, and Finflix evolves one, two more times. And there's another new encounter, Barball, which looks steel and poison. Interesting, but Bulldogs would not do good against you. you although, Bulldoze, that could have been quad weakness. Maybe take it down to one hit. Okay, it looks like a dead end item right there. And there's another bar ball. I bet it's going to have, um, god damn it, what that, what that ability is called that does damage on contact. But this doesn't make contact, so it doesn't matter. And thankfully, no sturdy. Oh, that's no EXP, really. That's not worth it. Let's see what this is. Maybe an Erip. Hey, there we go. You actually appeared. Oh, and you're generalist too, I see. Okay, Cloud9. Let's see. Because I used a whole bunch of Pokeballs. Because I made a couple catches off screen, remember? I caught a Wee Seed. And I actually caught a Shiny, um, Snuff. I mean, Snuff Fuzz too. Try an Ultra Ball. Because I'm not going to be able to really hurt it with Bulldox. No. Oh. Okay, Metal Sound. Maybe Rock Tomb could do some damage. Okay, Air Can always hits first, but it's not going to do anything. Okay, that did way more than I thought. Holy crap. So, I guess, um, Baldox me, um, Irip right here has no, um, defense, really. Each, knee, sun. There we go. Finally got Irimp. Let's see. Yes, yeah, Steel and Flying like I fought. Although, I fought before. Maybe it's your. Maybe you evolve. I could have swore it become a ghost type. Hey, a bright powder. Let's see. Could I give that to someone, maybe? Hey, you know what, Baldois? That actually could probably work well for you. Let's see. Oh, that's right. You're rocking ground, so maybe that can help you survive. I mean, fight against a grass or water type user. Just an idea, maybe. As let's see this new encounter. Another bar ball, which I battled already, did not give out any EXP, so don't bother. Bulldox. Okay, that's a dead end. So we gotta go this way, which I haven't done yet. 
Hey, pick up an item. Ep and bow first. And then pick up that item. There's... Oh, there's still one more encounter we have yet to see yet, but it's a rare one, 10%. It ties Fiant too as the lowest encounter. Why did I do... Rock Tomb? Okay, it's neutral damage. Ne okay, neutral damage. Although it looks... Maybe, maybe it's rock. Because if it was... Yeah, if it was ground, I don't think it would have been very... It would have not been very effective. And that was neutral, so it has to be on rock thing, because I think rock's neutral against other rock. Here we go, bar ball, one shot. And I'm probably not even going to get 500. Oh, I did get 500. Now let's go pick this item up. Hey, that'll be useful for the Elite Four, maybe. Since who knows what this game has, I have no idea, because I never got that far. Up oh, a double battle! And good thing I saw it, so let's see. 53, I mean 52, 39. Alright, ball doys! You're gonna go up front, and you'll be having your first ever battle in the series on you for YouTube. <sighs> Another counter. Another Moose Stone. Oh, oh! I, is this, okay, not triple. I was thinking like, oh boy, could this maybe be a triple battle? But nope. Barball. Earimp. Okay. All right. I know exactly what to do, although Bulldoze, I mean, Bulldoze is going to be hurt by Bulldox's Bulldoze, most likely. But, Rock Tomb, Earrimp right there. That's like the only thing I got, lower that speed. Mirror Shot, that's going to be super effective. Oh, God. Oh, great, lower its accuracy. Oh, oh, no, I forgot, too. Earrimp is, is immune. Oh, man. That's not good. And of course, the bar ball missed it completely. Got fucking lucky. The fucking mirror shot. You should be doing a uh, mirror shot instead. Oh my god, you had to hold on. At least bar ball got hit and it. Oh, that's right. Split around so not everyone's gonna take all the damage. I mean, everyone's gonna take less damage than normal. And Aaron, of course, survived. Now you're low enough, I could just do a bite. Didn't say you only had two encounters. I mean, two. Pokemon, so that would be kind of pointless to do spikes. Bite you? Wow, you're faster now. I mean, Bulldoze is now. Oh, that's right, you took the um, Bulldoze, so of course you're going to be slower. You took it twice, actually. One bite will finish you off. There we go. Alright, so. Oh, that's right, there's one more train right here, too. I hope this will connect to that route, because we got Route 7 coming up, too. And I think that'll actually lead us to our next city. Okay, Inrip, that's going to be trouble for Bulldogs, because you don't really got anything to hurt it with. Ah, Takedown's not going to do anything. Yeah, barely like any recoil. Bulldogs, why do you miss? Yeah, if you have Mirror Shot, we could be in trouble, actually. That might actually be enough to take you down. Okay, that's Air Can. That did a lot more damage because it's special and all. Hopefully your speed lower enough now. Come on, come on, come on. Damn it! Still too fast. Alright. Thank God it. Earrip is down. Barball. Okay, well that will definitely be a one shot. And of course the monitor went off. There we go. Got that fixed. You held on! Oh my god! Did it have, did it have sturdy or something? I didn't see actually. Well, at least we got rid of you, Barball. As Bulldox might be close to evolving, which I can't wait. So, let's see. Maybe if you get to 38 and you don't evolve, maybe I'll use that rare candy on you. Because it's either 38 or 39 when you evolve. I know that. I just don't remember which one it is. So, I gotta keep that in mind. If I got a rare candy, I'll use it on you. Ah, Maybe I go down here and get this item. Yep. Alright, looks like I hope I can get okay rock polish. Come on, connect, 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 connect. Okay, here's an item right here. Looks like... Hey, another rare candy. How nice. And looks like... Apricorn trees, yeah. Because, um... I did... I got my ap my um, apricorn ball earlier, and I already used it. So, now I got another one being worked on very soon. Sucks it's not like in Heart Gold Soul Silver, where you can have multiple ones done at the same time. Yes! They connect. I'll try... I remember there was a couple tree. And here we are. 
Root 7. And I see a berry tree in here. So I got Root 7 up. Same in... Oh, wait. No. There's one more encounter, actually. One new encounter. It's only a 5% chance, though. And there's also Parafoil, which is in the um, Headbuttable Trees. There's one encounter here, but it's only a 5% chance in the grass. It's 100% if you did Rock Smash, but... I don't have Rock Smash, so I can't do that. I hope it comes very soon. And I know and I need to surf um item soon eventually because I can't run out of places to go. Because this route coming up is a dead end eventually, so I need surf eventually. Hey care, of course we got Baller now. Yeah, so I need surf eventually because the next bunch of gyms I remember correctly are north of um Battle Bridge, like I said, the water right there. Alright, Carol, once again! She said, that's right, Water Starter. Which is Water and Poison, so this team would be perfect against you. Roby, wait a minute, didn't Rodney have one too? I don't remember. I think you're a ground though, so Bulldoze. No <laughs> oh, quad weakness! Oh god, Bulldog just held on. And of course, now I can't remove her either. Alright, hopefully, come on, speed be slow enough. I'm sure you're not though, because I can't switch you out. Oh my god, your speed actually was slower unless you're doing a lower priority move. Kid it. Me kid it. Only problem is it might not be slow enough. Sh oh, you had to have Bulldoze too. Oh, Bulldox couldn't get the level up here. Alright. <coughs> you know, for being a gigantic turtle, you're actually faster than Bulldox, believe, believe it or not. And there you go, one shot. I don't think that crit was necessarily Bulldoze. I would have rather you save it for someone who could need it. Dimblo, you're part, you're pure flying. Okay, I think it did a rain dance. Air hey, can, it's not gonna do anything, and you're gonna get one shot, hopefully. There we go. Yeah, that's how I like it. Don't even say lowered speed because you fainted. There's no point. Yeah, that's right. Dry skin, so the rain actually helping me. Thank you for that. And there's Salanip. Um, can't remember it. Saladit or Saladit's, um, sec, I mean, first, I mean, second, I mean, first evolution. And there we go. One shot, too. Because that's what my role play took. Pixely? And of course. Oh, wait, no, I've seen you be. I. No, I'm not sure I remember that name. Maybe it's a um, full evolved form. I have no idea. But of course, I know you're part bug, so. Enjoy that one shot, hopefully. There we go. There we go. Now, that crit would have probably been needed. It probably wouldn't have been enough if otherwise. There we go. Bulldoze, 38 now. Damn, Kara. Other than giving Bulldox a problem, you really got destroyed. But then again, it's not a surprise when I'm massively overleveled. God, I mean, like, some of my members look like they're, like, 10 levels higher almost than you. I'm so overleveled in this game already. Pick up this. Hey, will o -Wisp. that's not going to be useful for the gym coming up, though. Alright, come on, come on. And there's a Kitlet. I mean, Kitlet, which actually looks cool. Of course, I'm probably going to one-shot unless I did a um, Cross Poison. Because I actually might catch it. Oh! Oh, that was close! Oh my god, that was close. Use a Friend Ball. Which, matter of fact, that was a po those were the Pokeballs I think I got from that girl that we saved that, um, got her Pokemon back. She gave us five of these. So now I got two of them. Now it would be nice if you have a friendship evolution, because that would make the friend ball useful then. But that's still not the new encounter yet here. There's still one more. It's only a 5% chance. And there's another Bar Ball. Perfect, actually, because now we can level up here. And hopefully, Baldois, Bulldox will evolve. There we go, 38. There we go! Bulldogs is evolving, so I don't have to use a rare candy. Bulldogs, you've been on my team for a long, long time. You're like one of my first catches, too. Or at least in the first few episodes. And now, you fully evolved. And you look crisp, I mean, beautiful. Christox. Looks awesome. And what are you holding? Ooh, a super potion! Thank you, Christox. I guess you got that when you evolved. So let's check out your stats. Although your speed's a lot better, stats across the board are pretty damn good. But now, let's go move that over to Finflex. Finflex, of course, might be evolving soon, too, so maybe I'll use that rare candy on her on her instead. Perfect. Perfect. 
for Finn Flicks to take on. Paraful? I mean, Paraful? So, Rock Tomb? Okay, Screech, hopefully it'll be enough. Would be nice if you're part fully- Oh, you held on. I guess you're not part fire then because you would have definitely been one shot then. Why would you do that? Oh, Finn Flicks, why? You had to miss. That's gonna hurt more. Held on. Like that EXP bar is like completely full almost. Now I'm worried Finflix is not in the best shape, but thankfully I think this next city's come up ahead. No. Finflix. Alright, kind of risky, but Scorponova up front because Scorponova doesn't have really Alright, we'll see. If you're part if you're part fire, you'll not be very effective. Okay, uproar. Okay, it's neutral. So you're not fire. So I guess maybe you're normal and flying. Which matter of fact. Yeah, I'm looking at your um, thing right now. It looks like it says normal and flying on the site because they have the Pokeballs. I mean, the Pokemon, like on Bulbapia, colored by their um, typing. Oh, no. Looks like... Oh, man. I have no way to get around. Oh, man. Now I am going to have to use a um, revive because that's way... It takes way too long to get back. And I don't want to use a revive, um, rare candy because rare candies, I believe, can heal Pokemon up. But I don't want to use it since Finflex got like a fur the way to level him up. But I think Finflex evolves coming up here. If you don't evolve at 38, then I will use a rare candy on you. I need a map too. Although there doesn't like there's many trainers left. Golimo? Alright, well you're pure rock, so hopefully a one shot. There we go. As there's a map now. Hey, here we go! That's the new Pokemon! Hot Top! 5% counter. Looks like it's pure fire, too. Although a lot of the Pokemon in this game do like almost like cookie cutter version of each other. That looks almost like um Stoltox, which is Bulldox's first form, and a couple other Pokemon too. It's like so weird how they always look similar to each other in some regards. Here we go. Come on, go up. Ooh! A max potion. That'll be useful later on. I definitely would probably want to get a, um, stop, I mean, stop top or whatever it was called. Looked really cute. And I can't touch you, in rip, I mean, I rip. Or maybe it's iron and blimp together. I rip, perhaps, be pronounced. Not bothering that bolt, bar ball. Come on, upstairs. Oh, God, I got a funny feeling there's probably going to be an item right down there. And there's another kit. Kidlet, not gonna bother with. You. Oh god, you're not gonna let me go away. Come on, let me, let me. You won't leave me alone. All right, fine. How about this? Take a water pulse right to your face. Enjoy your one shot. Yeah, that's what happens when you don't leave me alone, dick. All right, no, you're a woman, so you're a bitch. How about that? And I knew there was gonna be an item down there. And of course, another counter, stop top or whatever. Another moose stone instead. How much exp do you give out? Maybe. Eh, not much. Not, like, worth it. Tiny mushroom, I could sell that. Where does... Ooh, another item! And there's another path, too! Let's see. Ooh, okay, Roost. I don't think I have anyone on the team I could learn that right now. Oh, it's a dead end. But hey, Finflix, what's up? Ah, you spun around in a circle. Would be nice if you had an item instead when I talk to you. Almost there, to the city. I'm not gonna battle the gym in this episode. When I get there, I'm gonna stop. Because actually, now that I think of it, I think there's something I need to do first before taking on the gym. Because I think Team Solar or Lunar actually fuck me medals around the city, so I think we gotta get rid of them first before we take on the gym. Oh! Why didn't you level up? Why couldn't you just level up? I mean, you're on the verge of maybe evolving too. Alright, now. Here we go, Hot Top, that's what the name was. Definitely want to get you, but like I said, a five percent chance to encounter. Although there is a one hundred percent chance if you have if you're able to rock smash. There we go. Dragon high. That's a new move. Let's see what it does. Okay, raise defense and special defense. You know what? I think I'm gonna. I'll, I think I'll do that instead because. Finflex is going to have a quad resistance to gym up ahead. So, hey, 
Might as well raise that def um, defense, special defense instead. Make you a, like an unstoppable wall almost. Okay, Moonstone. Yeah, you're fully rock. Take down. Okay. Oh, oh, crit. Okay, that did a lot. Okay, I see you have um, rock head, so no recoil. Interesting. That's a good um, ability for you to have that move with. Now, let's see. Will Finflix evolve? Oh, all right. Here we go. We're going to see. I'm only going to use one rare candy. If you don't evolve here, I'm, I'm not. I'm going to quit. I'm not going to use all of them on you. Nope. Darn. Well, I'm going to have to get it up to level 39 now. As we're going to put Scorpionova up front. And move that lucky egg up to Scorpionova. But we're almost there. As a matter of fact, there we go. And we finally arrived to High Point City. As this is the home of the 5th gym. But right now... I'm just going to go save and he heal up and save, and then I'm going to end the episode off here. But let's see what can you help you with. L uh, let me get... Actually, you know what? I do have a drink. Yeah, I actually found a drink in, the, in this episode, remember? Huh? huh? I, wait, it said I did found the drink. I remember find a drink in this episode. I mean, I'm off screen or something like that. Oh my god, what happened? I don't... Maybe I used it in this episode? I don't remember. I could have swore I had a drink. Oh, man. Oh, that's right, Johto's in this game, too. Bug grass, bug... Bug water. Well, I know one of them you're talking about, Fire Ant, which I do have. Bug and water... No, bug and grass, that's probably stick it you're talking about. I can't remember. Bug and water. Uh, I don't know a bug and water type off the top of my head, unfortunately. But that's going to wrap it up here as I'm going to get everyone up to level 39. Hopefully I can find a stuff top or whatever it was called in the next, I mean off screen. And then in the next episode, hopefully I can take on a gym. But like I said, I think I have to take care of something first before a gym. So we'll see what happens in the next episode. So see you guys next time.